Hello and welcome to another episode of Dad vs. Daughter. I'm Tim the Dad. And Maggie the Daughter. And today we are playing the brand new Star Trek 5 Year Mission. This game just came out at Gen Con 2015. Uh, we did a demo of it, liked it a lot, and bought it right there on the spot. So let's tell you how to play. First thing is we will show you the character cards that we get. We have our choice between the original series and Next Generation. So let's look and see who we have here. We have Captain James T. Kirk, Mr. Spock, Dr. McCoy, Scotty, Ahura, Sulu, and Chekhov. Now the game plays three to seven, that's why it goes from one to seven. On the back of each card is the next generation cast. So we have Captain Jean-Luc Picard, Commander Riker, Dr. Crusher, Geordi LaForge, Counselor Troy, Commander Data, and Lieutenant Worf. Now, if you bought this at Gen Con, you also got a bonus card, uh, and the characters on that are Yeoman Janice Rand from the original series, and on the back side, Will Wheaton as acting ensign Wesley Crusher. And Megan, what is the great thing about the Wesley Crusher character? Get to say, shut up, Wesley. Yes, if everybody says, shut up, Wesley, then you can do his action twice. Speaking of actions, Megan, let's see uh, Captain Kirk's card there. Now, you'll notice a couple different things on the card here. First, we have the character's ability. In Captain Kirk's case, that kind of sounds... Uh, a little weird. Captain Kirk's case. One time on your turn, you may re-roll all of the dice of a single color. So like all of your red dice or blue dice or yellow dice, and we'll talk about the dice in a minute. The other parts of the card is we have the actions area. This is where after you roll the dice, you're going to place those dice there and then decide which ones that you're going to use. The ones that you don't use on that turn stay there until your next turn, and then you can either re-roll them or use the dice faces uh, in order to complete the alerts. We also have the injuries area, which if a character becomes injured, you take one of their dice uh, that's on their board and you put it in the injured area. And you can only have up to five dice unless you have a specific special ability that grants you more. So if you have, say, two dice there, you're only gonna be able to have three other dice to roll. Okay, here's a look at the dice. They're a little smaller than normal dice, but they're still really good. Each player is going to start with five dice, two red, two blue, and one yellow. And as we go through the game and we use dice on alerts to complete them, they are going to go back into a dice pool, and then you can pick whichever color and as amount, the amount of dice that you want, up to five, or unless you have a special ability that allows you to grant more. So you'll notice that when we play the game. I also want to show the uh, Enterprise card here. This is their only difference between this and the back side is the picture. So on uh, the front side here we have the Enterprise from the original series and on the back side we have Enterprise D from Next Generation. We'll start with having a token here on the little start icon uh, and then certain things will make the Enterprise take damage. And when they do, we move the marker up on the track. When it crosses from blue to yellow, we're no longer able to take uh, blue alert actions. We can only take yellow or red. And the same when we go from yellow to red, we'll only be able to take the red uh, alerts. Now, above each of the dots here, you'll see a red die with a value. That means that we can repair the Enterprise if we have the dice face, or in the case of the arrow, that means anything higher. So say if we had the, the damage counter here, if we had a red six or a red five, we would be able to repair that much uh, damage on the Enterprise and then move this, the uh, marker down one more slot. But what we're gonna do in our game is we're gonna start with uh, this side of the Enterprise. Like I said, it doesn't really matter. The back side of the rule book has a handy dandy reference guide here. And this tells you what each of the turn sequence are. It also shows what are the special symbols that will be on the cards that we'll be able to use as a one-off. So 
if we need to, uh, we can uh, use these certain abilities like plus one to a die or subtract one from a die because as you can roll higher on some, some will require you to roll lower. So that'll come into play. We'll also be able to re-roll. It'll show you over here uh, what I was just talking about. You'll notice here that there is a box around these dice. That means that you have to play those all on the same turn. So you can't just place one uh, and then have Megan place another. Most of them, most of the uh, alerts, you can usually place one die here and there, but those will require you to do it all in one turn. It also shows the different skill levels that you can play at the game. There's six different levels. For this game, we're going to start off just because we want you guys to see what the game's all about at the instant level. So that means we need to have 10 points and one card has to come from each of the colors, the blue, yellow, and red alerts. It goes all the way up to Admiral where you need 20 points and two of each color. Okay, we always start the game with to boldly go uh, out on the tableau. And you'll see that this requires a blue five or higher. And this is always there at the beginning of the game. And if you flip it over, you'll see the Enterprise D. So whatever Enterprise you're using for the uh, dice pool and the damage track, you can go ahead and, and you can have that Enterprise match. It doesn't really matter. And here's what one of the alert cards looks like. Here's a blue alert. So you can see this one, and all the blue ones are like this. They have this little uh, line through them. And you'll see an image from the original series and an image from the next generation. They kind of all kind of go together. In this case, this says deliver supplies. You'll also notice that this has a yellow alert symbol. So that means whenever we flip this over and that symbol is there, then we also have to flip over a yellow alert too, as Megan is showing you there. Now, the yellow alert that Megan has, let's point out a couple things in the card. Here, this indicates that this is worth a point. So that's what we want to do. We want to make sure we get those. It also has this timer symbol. And the game does come with a three minute little timer. But what, what that means is when you roll the dice uh, on your turn, when this is flipped, you flip the, tar the timer over and it doesn't matter who completes it, but you have to complete it within the allotted time before all the sand runs out of the uh, hourglass. The way you lose the game is if you have five or more failed missions or the Enterprise blows up. So we want to try to avoid that if possible. And you want to know how you fail a mission. Well, if you have three cards already in the tableau for one of the colored alerts, and you happen to flip another card that would cause a fourth, the topmost mission would fail. And that's going to go over into a separate pile. There is one other little special card to show you here, and that is this prime directive. You'll notice by that symbol up there. What that means is you have to complete that card before any other card, uh, or any other alert card that you complete. If you don't, then all of these fail, which, so we want to try to avoid that if possible. So what we're going to do, normally you can, you can play the game any way you want, really. You can play with all old series, you can play with all next generation, or you can mix it up. And the cards, let me just show you one of the cards here, just to show you what I mean here they have this little enterprise symbol. And you'll also notice too that the image on the card is from the next generation and it has the enterprise D on here. If it was from the original series card, like uh, on this one here, they're very faint, but it's there. There's a picture of the other enterprise. So each of the alert stacks is gonna have 24 cards and you want them to match whichever enterprise uh, crew that you're using. In our case, since we are using both crews, or members of both crews, then you basically shuffle them together, you pick 24, and that's what you go with. So I think we're about ready. We'll get the board set up here and we'll play. Okay, so as you can see, we've got this set up. In a two-player situation, what we have decided to do is we pick one other crew member and we alternate on who gets to control that. The game tells you to always make sure you have a captain and a doctor. Uh, the reason why you need the doctor is because you need to be able to heal people. You can spend an entire turn and heal one dice, but that's kind of a waste. So we want to be able to use a doctor's ability. But since we are going to be going back and forth on who controls the dummy player, in this case it's Mr. Spock, we have an appropriate little marker. 
we have a Star Trek communicator. That was my idea. It was Megan's <laughs> idea. And actually, that was a brilliant idea. Bridge, this is the captain. And this is a Hallmark ornament, I think, from 2008. Uh, and it's got all these little cool scenes. As you can see, scenes. we have another problem. So, Megan, I'm going to let you go ahead and start first okay. with Spock. So you'll have that. And we'll be rolling our dice off of camera, but when we get them, we'll be placing them on our board in our action space. So the captain always goes first. Draw a card. Draw a card. I'll draw a blue one. Yeah, All right. Pops so, yellow. And we have text on the R&R &R card that says, if you place one or more dice on this alert, you are injured. So anytime you play a dice, uh, place a die on there, you're going to get injured. Good thing we have a doctor. And that's a timed one. Yep. Okay, so let's see what we got here. You have three, three, and five. You could actually get rid of that timed one right there. You have a red three, and then you can do any color three and four. Yeah. Three and five. So I can. Uh, we'll go ahead and I will do okay. that. So that completes that. That's a point. Cool. So we only need nine more points. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to place this three on this card, okay. which will actually cause me to be injured. So I'll just take my red die and I'll move it over to my injured area. Okay. So your turn. Flip a take card. That one. And then we have court martial. Let's see. I have have higher than a three. And then what's that on the other side? Uh, three. A white three. I don't have that. But you're gonna get, take an injury. Okay. And then oh, I have to use. Probably Blue, you want to use a yeah. red. So then I'll heal you for that. Okay. So Go ahead and read Dr. Crusher's ability. So during dice placement, you may use one of your blue dice to reduce one injury per crew member on a number of crew equal to that number on the dice. And so, it was a one. So So you're good. Kirk is healed. Yep. And then Spock's going to go. Okay, so that's a prime directive, so we have to do that one first. Okay, and that is Ambassador. So let's see, he's got this. This card also has the uh, the little symbol there that says one dies any color yeah. that you want to make it. So you, you can. Get it. So once you complete that, you're going to be able to mm -hmm. take it and use it. Well, there's the yellow once. five, which is good. Um, well, I've got a red six, so. Okay, and I can put that there. Well, oh, you no, we have to, to be able to do both at the same time. Never well, mind. you can because you have a red two, yeah, but and this has got to be higher. Oh, we've got to do the prime directive, yes. So he's going to hold on to these. Or should he? Or can do you think? Yeah, we because we don't want to fail okay. the prime directive. So let's hold on to those, and then we'll just do that. Okay. So, okay. And on to you. And what is Spock's ability? Spock's ability is one time on your turn after resolving an event, you may retrieve one of one of one die from that event and place it onto another event. Okay. So she now read sideways. I'm like, so I don't want to pull a blue because that would make us fail, so I'm gonna to have to pull a yellow alert. Yeah. And we get distress call, which is a timed event. Okay. That's also a point. So you, let me pick my die here. Uh um, some blue. Let's pick let's take some yellow. Take another blue. Another I would blue? Say, yeah. Because then, if we can complete this, we can just. Well, that doesn't out. matter what color dice they're. I know, but I mean, you have. But you, you can use here. the blue easier. Okay. I'm gonna let you keep the so blue, and I'm gonna take the yellow. Take yellow. Okay. Yeah. So. Uh, and I don't have to roll all my dice, and since this was a six for my last turn, I'll be able to place that uh, on the okay. ambassador card. Okay. So. So there's my roll. Okay. Hey, and I got a six. So. That's good. So there are the two sixes for that. That's good. This gets completed. That's not a point. And okay. this. No. Nope. No, nope. it's this one. Oh, it's that one. Oh. That course. was just prime directive. We oh, had to okay. do. Well, I get the benefit. I get to keep yeah. this card until I use it. You have a two and a four. You could put here. Well, I don't have a four. I have a five. Well, no, you're yellow. Oh, my yellow. Oh yeah. Duh. So and so, then yeah. you could put your five and do the boldly go mission. Yep, I will do that. So that will complete that. And that goes back to the dice pool. Okay. So now it's my turn. Okay. And I'm going to pick a blue. So if failed, the Enterprise takes one damage. And I'm going to take two blue. And do I have anything to help? Well, I've got a red five, which I could use there and get rid of that so it doesn't fail. So I'll hold on to that one. And I'll roll these. 
So I can do that, and that's good. Okay. And I don't have that. Um, do we need there? We need a blue Do we two. need a three on the R and R? Yes, any three will work. I'll do that. So that'll mean you're damaged. Damage, or you're and injured, then I, mean. I can. So that's three. So I can heal myself and get my dice back, and that's there. You rolled a blue three. Yeah. Okay. So now your turn for Spock. So draw a card. Okay. Well, we'll go ahead and draw a blue card here. And then. And this is hail ship. He can complete this, and he can complete that. He's got a, he needs a blue two. Oh. Though. Oh, no, he needs higher than a blue two. For well, that. I meant for this oh, one. for that yeah, one, We yeah. want to get that one done. You could roll for it, though. Yeah, let me get, let me take the, uh. But you could hold these for the court martial. Well, you I can. You could use this for the hail right. ship. Right. So give me the, give me the two blues. Oh, okay. And then, you want to take another blue? We've got Let's blues see. to see. I want to keep that there. two. Mm-hmm. So give me the five. I was going to say you could keep it for that. No, nah, that's okay. Okay, and then take another blue. Well, that's true. Yeah, so it's a five. Okay, we'll keep that. So put that one back over there. And then there. take another blue. So, all right, here we go. And I wanted the We're blue good. two. You got it. So Spock We're gets good. a blue two. Yep. So that is completed. No more time. I'll just that's let that point. run out. Hey, we got two points. Put that back to you. Okay. Or give that back to you. Um, you have higher than a two. You have two or higher, and you have two or lower. So, yep. Yeah. So, we're going to go ahead and do that. Because so you have to place those spots. at the same time. And you can do this one, too. We have, yep. So, we have cleared the board with Mr. Spock. That's good. Thank okay. you, Spock. So, back to you, Captain. Back to me. Well, and here's the other thing. The points are more prevalent in the yellow and red cards. Um, we're in pretty good shape, so I think I'm just going to still go with the blue. Oh, and we get a point. So I can get all the dice I need. I'm going to take, um, I don't know. Like, wanna... as long as you leave a blue for me to okay. heal, that's the only thing. So I'll just go ahead and I'll take five blue die. Okay. And I can re-roll them if I need to with Kirk. So... You got five. You don't have a five. You nope. should re-roll. So I'm going to use Kirk's ability. I'm going to re-roll all these since they're blue. Yep, there you go. You got, you got it right there. There is the five. There is the six. That's so point. there's three points, and my, the rest of my dice I will not use. They'll go into my action okay. spot. I'm going to be risky because we need one of each color. Yeah. So I'm going to pop a red. Oh. Until this card's resolved, crew members cannot communicate with each other because it is communication failure. And we need all ones. So. Until that's resolved? Until it is resolved. Wow. Okay. So, so nothing's wrong with your video. We're just not going to be talking. Mm -mm. Okay, so silence. Okay, I'm moving to Spock, so I'm letting people know that much. Okay, this one has, it says, Enterprise takes one damage, use only red dice this turn. And this is emergency repairs. Yeah, once you complete this, then you can play. Uh, that effect is no longer in effect. Okay, so. I just wanted to make sure before I put that. So, okay, now to you. All right, I'm going to draw a blue card. <laughs> I forgot to do that. And let's roll. Choose a crew member that crew member's injured. Make it Spock. That card is uh, Nerve Pinch. 
It's funny, Spock is injured on that card. Enterprise takes one damage. And uh, that is Patterns of Force. <clears throat> Excellent episode. I don't think I've seen it. <laughs> got it. We can talk. <laughs> and we got a point. Yeah. <laughs> so we're almost halfway there. Okay. And then three and five go there. That's another point. And now we are halfway there. I can't complete that one. Spock's now your control. Okay. And then I got this careful study card, which I can reduce the die okay. number. So that's a one off. I got that during our silent treatment. All right. Oh, hey, okay. here's a prime directive, but it's a point. And so, you can re-roll any of your dice with whoever gets it. Okay. Uh, I also have the ability that if I don't, I can use you any can make color any, die yeah. if I want. Um, let's go ahead. <clears throat> I'm gonna go ahead and grab the two blue here. Okay. Just because I want to try to get that one done. Mm -hmm. uh, okay, here we go. You're good. And no, you have a three. You have a three you can put there at least. I do have a three, but I could re roll them if I wished. It's up to you. I guess I'm gonna re roll these. Okay, four and three. I got that worked. three and a four, so that goes there. Prime Directive's good, you've got that. I actually have this, so I'm going to hang on to that, but okay. we have six now. Okay. So I anything cannot put else? anything no. on that, so goes to my action. <clears throat> okay, Megan, your turn. Okay, um, let's do a yellow. Okay, Ooh. that's a little difficult. Um, I'm just going to restock and take one of everything here get back to my starting dice amount so ooh, I can I like, can't can I complete that I don't know but we really haven't been using Spock's ability not really um no, I can't complete that. got a red that. three. I, yeah, I can put the three and the four in the, in the box and that part's good because we have to play those together yeah and then oh well, okay. And Let's make that point. a yellow, because I can put the red three up there. There you go. Because we'll do that, and then I'll move on. Okay. No one's injured. So you're Spock. I'm Spock. So yeah. I'll take these two, oh, and okay. let's see. You gotta flip a card first. Yeah, I gotta flip a card because it's important to flip a card so you know what you're going for. That's why what I was like, don't grab the dice because I don't so, know what they were. <laughs> let's go ahead and let's grab three red dice. So um, really if we fail the beam down, one injury to each crewmate. Okay, yeah, this is a beam down. We don't want to fail. Well, I don't think we're gonna fail that one. But oh, <laughs> look at there. It. So we let's, got two four. Let's see. We need a red four there. Red four. Red four, I'm going That's in. The wrong franchise. Let's see. It's yeah. Wrong star. Well, I can actually complete that if I want to, because really that's that's not going to well, come into play. Well, complete the place. beam down first before we get injured. Well, I know that so I need. So make sure you keep the right dice. Though. Oh, you know. Oh, that's Spock's dice. Whoa. <laughs> okay. A little faux pas there. Okay. I know I can use this and this on okay. that card. So I can use. Actually, I'll just go ahead and, and I'll use these two. Okay. On that. Um, so that's good. We're not taking yeah, damage. And so, that's, we're up to seven points. So that completes that. And Spock's ability is, remind me again? After resolving an event, you may retrieve one die from that event and place it onto another event. So I can take that red four and I can put it right here, which mm -hmm. doesn't matter because I drew one anyway. Yep. Now I can place my and yellow two and the five there. And that's and a point. We'll get that point. So we have to eight. Is that where we're at? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight. Eight. Yep. Yep, and can't do anything with that, so that goes back over there. You will be Spock, and back to me. Okay. So let's go ahead and let's, let's pop another keep, Yeah, let's keep blue doing alert. easy. We're doing good. 
Enterprise takes one damage. Oh, uh oh, so now we can only draw yellow alerts. Till we start healing her. So, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna take two yellow so I can try to get that completed. Although I have the uh, the ambassador card. Yeah. So, it's kind of up to you. Well, um, that that just allows your me. Your rolling to... just kind of sucked for what we need. Yeah. That it was did. bad. Um, you I re -roll? will. Well, I'm gonna use Kirk's ability and yeah. I'm gonna re-roll these yellows. Like re-roll the yellow. That's hey, there better. We go. There so, we go. what I can do is I will complete that. Okay. Uh, so shields up. So doesn't really matter. We'll okay, put that one up we've there. We've completed it. If nothing else. And that's about. I need a five there. Yeah, but you don't have a five. Well, I can re-roll, and you this re says I can re-roll all of my dice. Okay. Is that right? Let me just double check that. Yeah. Yeah. Re-roll re any. Reroll any of your dice. So you can reroll all so of them. So I'm going to use that. So I'll just go ahead and add that to the point pile. And then you can change the color even if you need to with your ambassador. Well, and I can reroll all of my dice. So. And it I did not matter. get a five. That sucked. Yeah, that was bad. Okay, then I'm going to try to fix your mess. All right. Hopefully. Beverly. Um, I'm injured. <laughs> That's what I get for trying to be helpful. <laughs> Um, I'll take a yellow and a blue. I'll just take all those and I don't need that. Okay. Ooh, four. There cool. we go. And then I still don't have that. But um I can heal myself, which is cool. So I get that back and that goes in the pool. And yeah. You can heal the enterprise. You got that right. You can six. heal the enterprise. We'll do that. Or repair the enterprise. So now we can well, I'm a doctor, I can do whatever. Okay. Did I pull a blue one when we were on the yellow, or not? No, you f flipped it. We got damaged, then we moved yellow. Okay. And then, yeah. Oh, I just, did I pull a yellow? I pulled a blue. You pulled I shouldn't a blue. have pulled a blue. You should not have pulled a blue. Oops. So, that's that's our faux pas there. Oopsie. But I want to tell you, since we are playing in the easy mode, I don't think it's really going to matter. The easy mode is really easy, so we're just going to keep playing on it. Oops. <laughs> Um, okay, so now I'm going to do Spock, so now we can draw from the blue, and it won't matter. <laughs> and it's a communication failure, and it pops yellow. And Enterprise takes the damage, again. So I'll move that up, and then... So now we can't talk, right? No talkie. Yeah, until this card is resolved, each crew may not communicate with each other. Hey, <laughs> this reminds me of that card in um, Escape. Yeah, the curse. That card sucks. You can't talk. Um, I can do. You can that, do that one. So that one's finally good. No biggie. And what the heck is that person? Well, you can play this. Ferengi. Ferengi. I don't know what that yeah. is. That's from the uh, next generation. Oh, well, I kind of figured that. I just don't. I haven't seen that episode. And well, we've seen a handful. You did make the Enterprise lose, or Yeah, take she went back up to yellow, so now we have to take yellow. Okay. And then Spock's you next. Okay, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All right. I have to um, thank BBC America for showing Next Gen episodes for me to watch. <laughs> so we've got one of each, so it doesn't really matter. So I'm just going to go ahead and pop a yellow. Oh, okay. Ooh, that's going to pop a red, red <laughs> alert, because this is the emissary. Good job. That's a timed, and if we fail, Enterprise takes two damage. Oh, wow. From the cor Corbomite Maneuver? Corbomite Maneuver, yeah, that's from yeah. the original series. Okay, I can kind of tell by the graphics there, but... <laughs> okay, so... Let's see, what do I want to take? Uh, I don't know, but it's timed, so we gotta... I guess I'll take a red We just can't to fail face. that, because if we do, man... Well, do I have any card, any that are going to help anything? You yeah. haven't changed the color of the dice. Alright, so I'm going to roll. Yep. Okay, what do I got here? Um, you have, I have a, a three. Blue three. I can fix that you can one. Do that. Well, there. Let's see. I've got that. I've got that. Yeah. So yeah. I, I can do that. Um, no, you don't have this though. No, but I can use Kirk's ability to roll okay. these yellows. You're good. So. Good, good, good. There we That's go. That's good. So. And you get that a card's ability. Which you can use someone else's ability. So I could heal, or I could actually use Spock's ability yeah. if, I, if I wanted to. Um, so I have a blue three. Get the so we'll complete that one. And, and I don't have a six. So 
That'll be my turn. I have a six, though. Yep. So. But we need yellow yeah, sixes. We can only draw yellow. Oh, that's a mind meld. Ooh. I'm going to take another yellow. And. Mm, I'll take a red and blue. And I'm going to leave that six there. Because we got to get fixing the ship. So, yeah, that's true. Um. Can't really do anything. Oh, I can put these here. There's no. Yeah. I'll do that. And then no one's injured, so we're good. And you're Spock, so you have a blue four. But right, yeah, draw so, yellow. So I'm gonna take. Or red. Oh, I gotta flip one. Draw yellow uh, or red. Okay, we got ambassadors. It's a prime directive, cred. Oh, we got um, so let's go and, and give it. Yeah. It's a blue four, which doesn't matter. And I think I'll take red just in case I can heal the Enterprise. Okay. Heal. I keep saying repair. Heal, repair the Enterprise. Okay. So, Spocko has... Spocko? Spocko. That's interesting. Um, wow. You didn't get anything to help. No. You Spock, are really bad at rolling. Spock stinks. He's got nothing here. No, he doesn't. So, okay, then. All right, so Spock. Spock's done for. You're bad. <laughs> it's only like when you get him, though. I can roll decently. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna take. Oh, you gotta flip a card. Oh yeah, I gotta. We wanna do card. yellow or red? So let's go red. I mean, we're already screwed. So space seed. That's a point. Oh, con the original. No, Before Benedict Cumberbatch. You want so much cure. All right, I'm gonna take three red, a blue, and I'm gonna use this yellow. I'm gonna hold on to that one. Yeah. I'm gonna use it there on the prime directive. We gotta hurry. So otherwise, we're see. gonna take two damage. Yeah, we don't wanna do that. Um, there's a, there's six. a six. That'll work. Yeah. And you know what? I'm going to re-roll these reds. Kirk's ability. Re-roll all these reds. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, okay. So We're good. That works. Actually, let's do it like this. Okay. There, there, and there. So that solves You this. get to keep that because it's an ability. Oh, yeah. I do get to keep so you that. you can change the dice color. I will use this red six, and I will he or repair the Enterprise. I'm not healing it. <laughs> and this two is not going to do me any good. Okay. Um, My turn yeah. Okay, let's flip a blue. That's a prime directive too. Crap! We're gonna fail. I have nothing. Okay. We need a yellow six. Take a yellow. Okay, and what other color? The doesn't matter. Okay, I'll just take blue. Oh, it's a six. Dang it! And I can only decrease. I can't add. Um. Dang it. Hurry, hurry. I know, I don't know, I don't know. Can you heal the Enterprise? No. No. Okay, I'm moving on. Just, ugh. ugh and a, out. But this so, one hit. <clears throat> so, and that's a time. Okay, so that one is going to fail. We take two damage. Fail. So we're going to put that in a failed pile. Let's put it over there. <sighs> and that was a point, too. Oh, well. We're, so, that's fine. It's only one failed. And we're okay on damage. One, two, four, five, six, seven, eight. We're not doing too bad. Okay, so we're, we're decent. So it's, so it's Spock's, Spock's turn. turn. Spock flipped that. Okay. He's got all his dice. So. Yeah, he does all have all of his okay. dice. Okay, ready? Yep. Go. Um, <laughs> oh, that was a three. That was and that says you were injured. I'm, what? Spock, Spock was injured. Come on. Actually, take one of those dice and throw it over in the injured pile. Sure injured. Yeah. Whatever. Oh, crap, crap, crap. I've got a one here. I'll just do that. Okay. And then oh, that was a prime directive anyway. Yeah. So that's good. We got it, though. Um, Because we didn't complete anything else. We just failed. Um, there's three. There's five. The red five. Yeah. There. Red five. That's a yellow. Yellow five. Colorblind. Okay, on to you. I'm thinking red five. I'm going keep, in. Keep rolling, though, because we've got time. Okay. So we need. Oh, you got the two. You have the two. Hold on to that two. All right. So, so get yellow, blue, and red. Uh, there's no yellow. Red. You've got all the yellow. I'm sorry. So we need blue <laughs> and red. So I'm just gonna go ahead and. It's a point too. You so know what? Just hurry up. I'm gonna take. Well, I'm gonna take the reds. So. Just yeah, just I'm just gonna take the reds so I can heal the or repair the Enterprise if I need to. Oops. Okay, well, you've okay. got the two. You so, got the red two. So there's the red and two. That's a point. Well, we're not done. Oh, oh yeah, we no, are no, done. We only have two. Like we're done. What are you talking about? 
There is a... Oh, I need, That's a point. We just need one more. Here is this. Yep. And I'll use these two to repair the Enterprise twice. Or you could have done the mine meld. But it's up to you. It's okay. It, it works. Yeah. It works out. Cause we need, we to, need to repeat we need to the repair. Enterprise good. Okay. And I'm going to hang on to that three uh, it's up for to Khan. So it's my turn. Maybe. Yep. Okay. Um, until this card is resolved, players may only place one die on their turn during the medical exam. Okay. Well, we only need one more that point. That sucks. Come on. Really? What do I have? Anything to help? I have a three. I'm going to hold on to that. That red three. I'll take another blue. All right. Because if I can get con, and then I didn't get con. Hmm. Well, the, the, uh. I can do the medical exam, so we're good. Alright. There's that. And I hold a four, so all our injuries are good, so Spock's fine. And that's it. I'm going to just hold on to that three. Okay, so you're Spock. Okay. You didn't just put a die on Spock, did you? No, I healed him. Oh. He was injured. Oh, you him. just moved it over. Okay. So Spock. Spock's got a draw. Spock's got a draw, yeah. Why do I keep... I don't know. Oh, okay. Let's see. Like Enterprise takes one damage. It's not too bad. Nope. So, he's going to hang on to that one. Okay. And he's going to take... He need, should he hang on to the three, just in case? Yeah, he'll hang on to that. So then let's blue. take... Two blue. Three blue. Three blue? Just take three blue. All right, we'll take three just blue. Just go for it. So, Spock gets... Did it. He got it. Okay, so... He got that. There is that. And that is Khan. They won. ten points. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. There's a yellow. There's a blue. There's a red. Ten points to Hufflepuff. <sighs> Yay! Hufflepuff. That's my house. I'm a Hufflepuff. <laughs>
Like and follow us on Facebook to stay current on our show schedule, sneak peeks at future shows, and to interact with us.